The jumbles destroys the Mahangu field of a pensioner Matthew Shivute, leaving the family with nothing to harvest this year. This year, the family plowed 10 hectares of their field with a hope to get enough food. Narrating their ordeal to NBC News crew, Tuhafeni Erastu says their efforts and money spent on plowing have all gone down the drain as elephants come during the night to eat as they wish. We only depend on our Mahangu field where we get food for consumption and sell surplus for an income to sustain ourselves. We are hard hit by the invasion of elephants and will not harvest anything this year. We need assist. The public relations officer of the Environment, Forestry and Tourism, Romeo Miunda, says the ministry is aware of incidents of human wildlife conflicts across the country. Many of these are reported towards harvesting time, mainly in the northern regions. We know that in the Omsata region there has been uh, reports of crop damages there that uh, the ministry staff members have uh, actually uh, responded to. We want to take this opportunity to sympathize with the communities as well as farmers who have incurred uh, losses as a result of um, elephant invention in their crop fields. The staff members of the ministry are charged to, uh, to respond to these, uh, to these cases in a, uh, in, in, in a rapid speed and immediately. We know that for the Omsati region at the moment, the uh, two elephants that have been declared to ensure that we reduce the impact that has been caused by these elephants. He called on the communities to report incidents of human wildlife conflicts to their nearest conservancies or the Ministry of Environment for them to be assisted not only in mitigating the impact caused by elephants, but also to see how they can be removed. Donatania Imbodi, NBC News, Amaupa Village.